It's Memorial Day weekend, so time for some quick history. Did you know that the very first Memorial Day was commemorated by African Americans at the end of the American Civil War? Yes, indeed. It took place in Charleston, South Carolina, just weeks after Lee surrendered to Grant in the spring of 1865. Recently emancipated African Americans created a formal cemetery and gave proper burials to 257 Union soldiers who died at a nearby Confederate prison camp. Then, on May 1st, 1865, they joined with some white missionaries to commemorate these men that they called martyrs. The event drew 10,000 people, mostly African Americans. Black children paraded and sang songs, black preachers delivered sermons and led prayers and spirituals. Some white Union soldiers also delivered speeches, and everyone decorated the graves with flowers. But this story soon disappeared, and for the next 130 years, Americans were told that Memorial Day originated in 1868 when a white Union officer called upon people to decorate Union soldiers' graves with flowers. Then in 1996, historian David Blight rediscovered the story in the course of his research for his landmark book, Race and Reunion. He wrote, quote, The war was over, and Memorial Day had been founded by African Americans in a ritual of remembrance and consecration. So the official Memorial Day may have started in 1868, but thanks to the research of David Blight, we know that the first celebration of Memorial Day took place in 1865, three years earlier, and African Americans were at the center of it. Have a great Memorial Day weekend, everyone.